Hey Mark, how's it going? Good, Sid, how are you doing? Good, good. Hey, you've done this before. You've come here to Malawi. Yeah. Two what years ago. Two years ago. For, what brought um, you back? Doing water wells. It's, it's addictive because not only does it give us the opportunity to serve others, but because God is ministering to us. We uh, in America need to mingle with and serve these folks every bit as much as, as they need us. And right. So it's, it's humbling. God teaches us patience me personally um, right. it reminds me of how blessed we are in, in our affluence and yet also at the same time what a distraction in it and uh, that can be right so right this is a good way of grounding yep. me back into what's bringing me back to what's important right loving God and loving so others. while the guys are getting ready for the next stage I know we're doing a lot for the village with the well what else are we really impacting their lives uh, well, with. after we'll start with a well, and, and the, the guys will work with the men here, while the women are um, ministering to the women and children, doing crafts and and lessons that that are scripturally based, games that are whether the women and children are learning scripture. But then at night, we show the Jesus film, and we have it in Chichewa, their their uh, language here, and um, what kind of reaction do you get? Oh, it's amazing. <laughs> Nearly everyone, they're so open to the truth, yeah. to the gospel. When they see Jesus speaking their language, um, they're ready to respond, to come to him, because they know that it's truth. It's truth that is saving. Very cool. Thanks Very for true. being here, Mark. You bet. Thank you, Sid.